Hi guys, Sean here from StudyClicks, and in this video we're going to be taking a look at Theorem 15, which is the converse of Pythagoras' Theorem. So first of all, we're just going to explain what's meant by this term here, uh, the term converse. The converse of any theorem is the same theorem stated in reverse. So uh, an example of this in everyday language might be, uh, let's say that I like going for ice cream every time the sun comes out. The converse of that statement would be, every time the sun comes out, I like going for ice cream. So it's just the same thing in reverse order. And in this case, uh, we were told that if the square of one side of a triangle is the sum of the squares of the other two, then the angle opposite the first side is a right angle. So obviously it rings quite similar to Pythagoras' theorem, but it's in the reverse order. So in this case, we know that we have a triangle here with sides A, B, and C. And we know that the length A squared is equal to the length B squared plus the length C squared. And if we know that this is true, uh, we actually know a few things, but the first thing we know for sure is that A is the longest side because it's clearly bigger than B and C. And because when you square A, it is equal to uh, B squared plus C squared, uh, this angle opposite A is in fact a right angle. So uh, that's it for this theorem, and I'll see you next time.